viewers, welcome to Youth Folio. It's festival time in the Northeast with Assam just having celebrated the Mago Bihu and Arunachal Pradesh seeing many joyous events. We bring you some glimpses of these festivities which could be celebrated with much gusto due to peace in the region. The Prime Minister's visit to Assam and Sikkim was another cause of joy for people of the region. Watch on! Prime Minister promises slew of developments in Assam. Prime Minister inaugurates Sikkim Organic Festival 2016. Union Minister for Forests Prakash Javadekar inspects quake damage in Manipur. First broad gauge train rolls into Tripura. Assam celebrates Mark Bihu joyously. Prime Minister Narendra Modi's 19th January trip to Assam received a very warm response from a large turnout of people who gathered to hear him at every venue. At Bodofa Nagar in Kokrajhar, Assam, where Prime Minister Modi went at the behest of newfound Ali, PPF, or the Bodoland People's Front, he was welcomed with a traditional Bagrumba dance and a huge crowd of cheering people. He announced the government's decision to grant scheduled tribe status to Bodo people residing in the state's two hill districts as also to the Karbis living in the plains. Bade Santosh ke saath kehna chahta hu ki Asam ke Karbi Mikri tribe ko Madani ilake mein Scheduled tribe ke rup mein aur Assam ke Bodo Kachari tribe ko tribe Anglongor NC Hill Autonomous Council ke ilako mein scheduled tribe ke rup mein goshi kiye jane ka mudda kaafi samay se lambit hai. Ab dono hi maslo ki Registrar Central of India or National Commission of Scheduled Tribes Dwara Sifaris Kardi Gai Hai Ane Wale Kuch Samay Mein Ye Mamla Cabinet Mein Approve Ho Jayega Aur Uske Baad Parliament may jaakar ke isko parit kiya jayega. A slew of other welfare announced included granting of deemed university status to the Central Institute of Technology, Kokrajhar, and reopening of the Rupshi Airport. The Prime Minister said that his heart and hands were open for the Bodo people. Industrialization ko badhava dene ke liye Central Institute of Technology, Kokrajhar ko एक वर्ष की अवधि में डीम्ड यूनिवर्सिटी का दर्जा दिया जाएगा इस कार्य से यूनिवर्सिटी को और अधिक एकेडमिक तथा एडमिनिस्ट्रेटिव ऑटोनॉमी प्राप्त होगी अर्लियर बीपीएफ चीफ एग्जीक्यूटिव मेंबर Hagrama Mohilari asked the Prime Minister to sanction Rs 1,000 crore for the welfare and development of BTAD, among other things. BTC ko develop karne ke liye hamara apka madad chahiye. Hamara BTC ilaka me bohut samaysa hai, bohut samaysa hai. Usko samadhan karke dene se ham bohut acha lagega, ham bohut acha lagega. Aur ye hamara BTC में BTC में बहुत रोड बनाना है, ब्रिज बनाना है, एजुकेशन सेक्टर में डेवलप करना है, और ये एग्रीकल्चर सेक्टर में भी डेवलप करना है, हेल्थ सेक्टर में भी डेवलप करना है, और हमारा जो भी हो, आसाम के अंदर में वो BTC इलाका बहुत अंदर डेवलप है, आप देखो, हमारा यहाँ में कुछ नहीं है, 
आप लोग का सरकार के दिनों में हमको पाँच सौ रुपया पाँच फाइव हंड्रेड करोड़ दिया था इससे हमने बहुत इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर बनाया कम्युनिकेशन का साइड में बनाया और एग्रीकल्चर टेक्टर में जो भी हो और आप हमको और वन थाउजेंड करोड़ और देने से बहुत अच्छा होगा ये बी The Prime Minister was accompanied by PMO and Donor Minister Dr Jitendra Singh, Youth Affairs and Sports Minister Sarbananda Sonowal and former Congress Minister and now BJP member Himanta Biswa Sharma. Apart from the Kokrajhar rally, the Prime Minister also unveiled the plaque for the foundation stone of Electronics and ICT Academy at IIT Guwahati and also addressed a large gathering of students of IIT NIT and others here he urged the youth to take full advantage of the opportunities present in the country and abroad he was joined by assam chief minister shri tarun gogoi beside central ministers shrimati smriti irani and sarbananda sonowal and others a third major program in assam was addressing a youth rally at the veterinary college grounds khanapara guwahati he was welcomed here by party members with traditional assamese gamcha Shawl, wooden rhino, chappi, and sharai. Addressing the rally before the Prime Minister, Himanta Biswa Sarma, followed by Sarbananda Sonowal, heaped accusations on the Tarun Gogoi government, blaming it for lack of development in Assam. Prime Minister Modi promised progress and urged the youth to take advantage of various government schemes, like the Prime Minister Mudra Yojana.